Peoria is still picking up the pieces after 50 power poles came crashing down last night. And APS crews have been in cleanup mode all day out near 83rd Avenue in Cactus. The National Weather Service confirms wind gusts of 50 miles an hour. And today, the Peoria School District had to cancel classes for several schools because of the outages. Fox 10's Irene Snyder spent the day in Peoria to see how homeowners are coping. It was horrible last night. First thing I've ever seen in my life. Heavy storms ravaged much of Peoria, leaving thousands without power. Our neighbor got most of the damage down the park a little bit. There's a few awnings missing to the to the carports. It was raining really bad, and then we we're watching TV, and all of a sudden the the storm got really bad. Can't open the door, and we noticed that it was a loud bang, and we saw that pole behind us that it fell, and we saw these wires on our trees. This neighborhood at 79th Avenue in Peoria was hit very hard. Several down power lines, much of 79th Avenue is closed, and several homes are blocked by the down lines. There was no power, so uh, APS said it was going to be back on like around 1030. Not at all. We heard a big crash, and then we come out. There's a bunch of uh, rain going on, and we noticed that the power lines are on top of his car, my brother's car. Many residents have left their homes, staying with relatives until the power is back and they're hoping that'll happen soon. Last night with no AC, it was really hot, and then our food and our fridges are going bad, so they don't know what we're gonna do. Irene Snyder, Fox 10 News. There are resources for people affected by the power outage. According to APS, they'll be reimbursing people for ice to keep refrigerators cool. That was a good one. Yeah, wow, that was intense. Uh, photos and videos like these from our viewers, we, we love seeing them. We love when you send them to us. They help us tell the story from across the state when we can't be everywhere. Uh, this is a massive lightning strike here from Stephanie in Cave Creek. And here's some video from Beta Rita and Sholo. The rain really coming down in this area as well. Big thanks again to our viewers for sending in those videos and we love to see pictures as well. Keep them coming. You can scan this QR code there on your screen or you can share them on our Fox 10 Facebook page as well and then you can watch for them right here on the news.